hello and welcome of course it's Harry Freshness and this is Naja BBB. Welcome to my Wednesday Chronicle. And today we're talking about zodiac signs and compatibility in relationships. by a post I saw on um, Instagram a couple of days ago and I was thinking like oh my goodness this could be me apparently they were telling a girl that she was going to break a good relationship because of her belief in Zodiac and I'm like that is what I would do now we calm down don't judge me <laughs> bad bad experiences you know what I think they say once you think twice shy I'm guilty okay so the first time I came across you know zodiac signs and stuff I was in the university and I was taking somebody who really cared and I cared about him and things were good you know and I'm like oh my goodness this guy's always coming up with things and I and that was the same time I studied into you know personalities like you know someone being a sanguine the maric I'm sorry I can't remember the correct pronunciation I know I did research but don't be angry <laughs> I will I will and then I'll talk about it again so anyway, I'm like, ah, oh, I beg, and I'm a Leo. Now, if you know a Leo, you know that our bashes are like, Wee! everything is like on a high because we are, we are a fire sign, you know, we're ruled by the sun, everything is always, ha, 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 you know, and I figured, oh my God, he's an earth sign, he was a tyrant, and I got no problem. Oh my man, I'm a scientist, I should have known that earth and fire don't, but, but I was in love and I was silly, so I just went to it. And then after years and years of trying to make it work, it just wasn't going. And then one of those days when I was not doing anything, I went and checked and I realized, oh my goodness, this is him. Oh my god, you're describing him. Exactly. So, well, needless to say, the relationship didn't go far. But it was not because of that, it was because of other things. Anyway, this is the reason why, like I said, once meeting twice shopping. And then I actually took time afterwards to go and check out these things, find out, you know, the signs that are most compatible with me, which is the air sign, you know, the element, the Aquarius is most compatible, Gemini, and then my fellow fire people, like Aries. And relationships with them, not just, you know, sexual relationships, normal relationships with these people always seem to be easier for me. So I think, um, there is a degree of truth you know there are certain things you need to ask your partner or someone who is interested or interested in before you get married i think one of the most important is the genotype and then after the genotype probably you need to know their core beliefs and values you need to know how they treat their mom they treat their younger ones these things are important guys believe me you might think oh now your family we can do that is it like we do it to you and your own family too you have to know and then i also think knowing someone if you're not into zodiac signs you should know the person's love language you should know the person's personality because these things somehow do you know they find a way to cross into your everyday life and you need to be able to say okay i can deal with this i can't deal with that you would change you wouldn't change i think it helps guide guide or inform your decision anyway so um i'm still going to talk i think i need to talk about love languages and personality yeah, I'm in the office and I'm shouting because I need you guys to hear me. So anyway, it's been nice talking about the signs. I, I, I'm guilty. I probably, I most probably will end or no, I most probably won't let a relationship start with a guy whose the sign is, you know, to mine. I'm guilty. I know. And let me know what you think, guys. Um, of course, remember to like, give me a thumbs up follow by subscribing and then check in the info box for my social media handles and follow me i do a lot of crazy stuff but sometimes i'm not that bad <laughs> it's a nice time to see you guys it's hurry up freshness when the chronicles say to you of course on friday i'm doing the second video for the back to school my baby's gonna be there i promise take care